Good afternoon, I'm Faye Barker. The Home Secretary says new data showing existing COVID vaccine offer high levels of protection against the Indian variant is positive, but has warned it's not green lights all the way for ending restrictions next month. A study by Public Health England shows both the Pfizer and AstraZeneca jabs work almost as well against the new strain as they do to fight the Kent variant in preventing symptoms. However, the report has highlighted the importance of people having two doses. Katie Barnfield has more. The Home Secretary also denied earlier the government was following a policy of herd immunity in the early months of the pandemic. Boris Johnson's former adviser Dominic Cummings made new allegations about the strategy last night on Twitter. Well, our political correspondent, so Carl, what is Dominic Cummings alleging? Well, herd immunity was literally the official plan in all documents, graphs, meetings, until it was ditched. In the ministers, including the Home Secretary this morning, say absent. Oh, thank you. Journalist Martin Bashir says he doesn't believe he's harmed Princess Diana in any way following his controversial interview with her in 1995. In learned. Congo's Mount Nirogongo has erupted for the first time in nearly two decades. The volcano... Finally, the UK scored nil point for only the second time in Eurovision history last night. That's it. We're back with the evening news at 5 to 7. Until then, enjoy your afternoon. Bye-bye.